Franchise from Japan. Daily homemade noodles. Skepti skeptical? Quite. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Look like the menu haven't changed for like 10 years. Did you before me? Yeah. Long ago. In a distant land. <laughs> from Tokyo to KL. Wow. We're so near, but so far. Oh, Singapore also got it. Indonesia also. Okay. Oh, it's a chicken soup, but with pork. Uh, garlic, garlic, garlic. Any drink order? Um, drink. Uh, cold. Same cold green tea. Thank you. Hey, they got daikon, right? And you got chikua mentai mayo cheese yaki. What does that even mean? Wow, look at this one, yeah. Do you want some ramen with the greens? Uh? Oh, thank you. Dude, so much greenery today. This is Botanica Garden ramen. <laughs> okay, I don't know what to order. Lah. Fuck me. Order the standard one. The standard one. This one and this one, same. Same with Ah, that's the egg one. Uh, non spicy. What's the difference between this and this? Uh? Oh, this one more separate onion, normal one. Ah, okay, I want this one. It's not very spicy, it's a bit only. Right? Yeah. Um, can I get a, a daikon and a gyoza? Gyoza, friend, uh, fried Oh, one. sorry, I want the fried one. Yeah. Okay. Okay, thank you so much. Skeptical. This place is so dark, right? It's like a Japanese horror movie drew on type of shit. I don't know, it just says Japan 3, I think. What is it, Japan 3? Yeah, it's a Japanese 3 talk. Mm. Mm. But, yeah. but this feels right, like a real Japan place, lah, if you ask me. Remember when we all went to Osaka, then we see this random fucking ramen place on there, it's quite bad. Right? <laughs> it's the same vibe, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, mic, microphone, microphone. I thought it's a mouse. <laughs> what, mouse? Uh? No, that's mouse cat, right? Uh, oh, like a mouse. Uh. <laughs> mouse, mouse, mouse. Fast? Yeah, it's, it's shocking. Less than five minutes. Yeah, man. <laughs> You're like, oh, yeah, why you drag me to this bullshit? <laughs> Good. You're like, yeah, I didn't say it's good. I'm saying it's okay. <laughs> the soup looks very thick. Uh. Yes. Do you taste chicken? Is it? Wow, serious? Uh? Say right now, it's got some. Try yours. Because uh. mine is a bit spicy, because I asked for spicy. Mm. Should I have gotten spicy? The spiciness clouds the soup a bit. What do you think? Uh, I'm gonna mix it now. Oh, thank you. Hey, unique. They put a type of seaweed into it. Okay. Two types. I ordered the chashu and I ordered the kakuni. So at least you can tell the difference. Mm. Whoa. They didn't ask for noodle texture. Uh. But it's, it's pretty good. Uh. Yeah, reminds me of Yokohama ramen a bit. Uh, go for it. Uh, this is the chashu. Mm. Wow, chashu is good or 
daikon. Wow, so flavorful. The meat damn good lah. The taste also. Wow. What is impressive is it's good, right? And it was so fast. <laughs> Good choice, man. Huh? You gonna try this? Take a bite. Overall, it's like a very well balanced bowl, man. The richness of the the soup pairs very well with the noodle, and the noodle has a good grip on the soup as well. The meat is damn tender. I think the only comment is like the interior. Man. Oh, thank you. Right, this is like the outlook when you come here, like. Uh. But overall, it's like a very decent experience, man. Like the the daikon is incredibly flavorful. It's rose, it's smoky or something. It's a. Uh, let me try it again. They boil it in a dashi, which is basically like a konbu and bonito. You strain the bonito and the konbu, then you boil the da the, <laughs> and then you boil the the daikon in it, which makes this, the thing a bit sweet uh, because of the daikon flavor. Let's try the gyoza. No, the egg. Oh. Okay, can I just eat it on top? Go for it, man. Ooh, wow. Not bad, huh? Mm. A bit overcooked. Got the soy sauce yeah. later. But center very nice, huh? Okay, I'll try my egg also. Now that you say that, I also need to try my egg. My egg got cracked. Wow. Not bad, huh? Yeah, man. <laughs> Yeah, very custard. Quite incredible, man. Objectively speaking, you keep like wanting to go back for a second bite, third bite. Not so jelly. I mean, I keep wanting to drink the food. Yeah. <laughs> so rich. Thank you. Let's try the gyoza. Gyoza looks okay, lah. You know, they put flour and water, then they all stick together. Looks like it's vinegar with a bit of chili oil, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's a bit better. I feel like there's a lot more pork oil taste inside the gyoza. Compared to many others, which is quite dry, and then they put too much ginger, I fucking hate that shit. You know, good balance, uh, but hard to steal the show from the ramen and the daikon. Really quite a highlight of the weekend. <laughs> I'm glad like the yoga, I work hard for this and I eat it versus going to like a shitty place that I die and then regret. Okay. But it's better than a lot of yoga. The chunks of pork are, are, are different, you know, not so consistent. You don't want consistent tummy because after that like quite boring like keep chewing the same thing. Put your wallet like that. Shoot, man. It's Subang, bro. <laughs> what? Oh. Oh, Photo damage. Is that the Arabic shop? Is it? The one we had that time. Is that called? Yeah? This is baklava, lah. Uh, but baklava. down here is not, lah. I don't know what's that. This baklava in like one pan skin. <laughs> yeah, you gonna try? You take one baklava gone, please. Yeah, man. Can't eat it. Oh wait, on. Let me just do the Marutama ramen. Yeah, nine out of ten. The only downside I feel right is the interior of the place. You all need to like make it look more attractive, lah. If you look at Ipudo, you look at. I think they just need to work on the interior a bit. If you work on the interior, it will be a, a lot more welcoming. The downside is when you eat it, right? It tastes fucking good, right? But you get full really fast and it doesn't look as appetizing presentation wise and it comes too fast. And... But other than that, right? The soup, the noodles, the meat is all spectacular, man. It's like serious. I cannot find any downside in it. Maybe the noodles could have been a bit harder. I don't know. And the, the, the garlic chips were incredible. I didn't record that. But yeah, man. Marutama, fucking underrated. I cannot find any bad thing. What, what do you think they can improve on with the ramen? Yeah. Oh, I think they should work on the decoration. The interior only, right? But other than that, it's damn good, right? Yeah, man. 
you can go up. Uh, let me know if you guys have tried Narutama also. It's quite out. It's, nobody really talks about it. I think it deserves recognition like, if you ask me. Really like Seta Gaia also. But Seta Gaia better like. Maybe Seta Gaia is better or what? No, what Seta Gaia is nowhere close. Both is chicken broth? No. Uh, I think Seta Gaia is better as a chicken ramen. But this one's got pork. So it dilutes the chicken smell a bit. So nice! Yeah. Maybe a 8.5 or a 9. La. I'm in between 8.5 or a 9. Yeah. Let me know if you, what you guys think. Like, comment, and subscribe, guys.